Yeah, I've lived here all my life. Yeah, family's been here since uh, 1866. What I remember in the booming downtown area and all the different merchants, uh, it was wonderful. It was a big thing for us to come to town. I lived in the country. I was born and raised here in Augusta, less than two blocks away. Yeah, my grandfather was a county judge here. He was an attorney in, in Augusta years and years ago. Um, every day when I walk to the post office, just, you know, seeing people and waving and everybody is just, it's like a big family. Everybody's welcome and you could probably, any Sunday morning, you could probably go to any church and, and be welcomed at any of them. No matter what you look like, what denomination, you could be welcome there. It's just, everybody gets along. You know, being in business here for all these years, it's just, it's family. I mean, it was just a river town and people spent their money on Saturday downtown and they stayed there all day long. So I'd, I'd like to see that happen again. If this takeover happens, I see a boom. I see, a, I see a, se several more businesses wanting to come in. I think it would actually spur industry. I think it would spur uh, commercialism. And I think it would spur a sense of pride in this community. I believe people uh, would want to return here. I've always said that I felt like they were marketing this area wrong, that it should be a place where people who grew up here would want to come back and retire and live here. And um, I still believe that. We would be appreciative because we'll be back where we need to be. We're a quaint little community sitting on the river. People come in to do their hunting or fishing or whatever. It would be a wonderful place. It'd be good for Augusta to have that to happen. Um, just wonderful and you know and trying to get companies so loud some are coming in just be good i think it would help with some of that aspect of it too anyone who would like to come into this little small community would find themselves in an environment that is very very productive minded and would love to have somebody come in and with ideas and and some of the leaders of the community our mayor uh, and, and the city council uh, would certainly be willing to work with, with some developer to come in to, to, to try to revitalize our little community. Let's show everybody what kind of spirit that Augusta, Arkansas had here in this school. So are we ready to live it up and live it today? Yeah. Invest in a town that has 200 plus years of culture and history that has sent ambassadors all over the state and all over the United States from Augusta High School or from Woodruff County and they still call Augusta home. The ties, the degrees of separation of the ties to here are pretty impressive. So to be a part of rebuilding something that was once great I would think would be way more monumental than going to a town that's already got the easy base. You know, who knows what it would be like if we don't get somebody in here that could help us along and everybody's doing the best they can and I mean there's just so much potential for growth and there's a lot of people that care about this town. There's, there's too many people here that, that want to see it look better, uh, more businesses, people will, will, will carry on. But really, really important, is it really important to have them come in and do this? Yes, it would help a lot. I would like to see uh, HGTV come in and help us with that. We've got a beautiful downtown, we've, we've, we've three-fourths of our buildings are already re-renovated. I would love to see the sidewalks and the streets and, and some more beautification put in, maybe some small islands right there where the sidewalks come out. I mean, something we can really showcase. We're all right here. Everything's right here on this river. I like to help beautify that. And we've still got some, some things that need to be done down here. And the more we do, we, we get comments all the time about this is the best looking little city that they've ever been in. But it can, there's more that can be done and the more we do, the better it looks and the better it looks, the better we're going to be off in the long run. There's things downtown happening where you can walk downtown, you can go in this store, this store, this store, this store. And you know, now there's, there's not even any vehicles on Saturday downtown. So I'd like to see that come back.